All right, welcome back. This is uh, Rimroll 1.0. After many, 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 many years, it has been released. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm not really sure what's, what's all been added. I just um, disabled all the mods that uh, I had subscribed to. And some of them were not updated and I didn't want to, you know, risk anything. Um, so yeah, I don't know. Uh, we're gonna go with the, I think we're gonna go with the um, normal crash landing. Um, I'm not quite sure yet which sort of um, landscape we want. Alright, let's dive into this. Um, yeah, I think we're gonna basically go for the uh, standard settings here. We could go for the random guy. Um, but no, let's let's go with the standard settings for now. Um, for the seat, uh, I have to start naming things already. Huh? Uh, I don't know. Let's go with something completely random. Uh, I'm gonna go 55% coverage. I think that's a good compromise. So let's see what this does. World generation does work quite a bit faster than it did when they first introduced it. There we go. Yes, it is much faster. All right, so we got a uh, we got ourselves a plan here. Oh, that is nice turn. Look at this nice little peninsula here. Yeah, the, this whole coastline looks actually very aesthetic. Uh, the South Polar ice cap, of course. Yeah, fifty percent coverage is, I believe, pretty decent. But of course, um, especially the ice caps look kind of wonky with it. Gentle Minna, nice uh, inland ocean here. Nice bay. Yeah, I'm liking this. This is uh, really beautiful. Look at this. Nice one here as well with a nice big island here. Very, very nice. Now, we could, in theory, just go with a random location. I'm not sure. Alright, so let's see. What are we gonna... I like uh, areas that actually are cold in the winter so that we get some snowfall um i don't want to try anything too crazy right so no no i should run for my first attempt here although of course then i would have a nice excuse for actually dying <laughs> um tundra eh, scrubland maybe scrublands scrublands uh, we're not gonna go with, um... Well, maybe something like this here, where there's, a, like, a highway and a river. That might be fun. Uh, that's a dirt road and a river. Hmm. I like the idea of a scrubland. Oh, this is actually... An interesting area here. I'm never gonna pick it. All right. Granite, marble, limestone, huge river, ancient asphalt road. Ooh, you know what? Let's actually pick that. Huge river, ancient asphalt road. Let's see what this looks like. It's a little more growing season. It's a little less cold, but I like it. Um, we are also not gonna piss off any natives. This is a little less rain. That's unfortunate. Um, well, let's let's go with this. It's a little closer to the mountains as well. I, I like the idea of having a river and a road here. So let's see how this looks. All right, uh, for colonists. So I like to mostly go with what they uh, give us, but obviously we need to have a team that actually works. Um, Let's see. All right, so we have a medieval doctor here in theory. All right, this guy is definitely... Oh, he can't do art. He's gay and an eye at all, so that works. Um, he He's really good at construction, and he is a good fighter. Mining, construction, some crafting. I think this guy is definitely in Schlitzer. Uh, this guy here, I think, is definitely out. Grub. Um, Manus. 
A jogger and industrious. That's really good, but his abilities maybe not that great. So I think we should probably uh, ditch these two guys. Schli well, no, not Schlitzer. Schlitzer is in. Yeah. So Grab and Dredge. Uh, they, I think, need to go. Let's see what we have here. Um, we want ideally people who who can do everything. All right, this guy is interesting. He told me. Oh, sorry, this girl. Uh, she's interesting. She's really good with animals. She's really good at planting. I mean, she's some passion for it. And she has a decent skill. Uh, not good for much else. She could be our, our uh, tender person, whatever. Let's uh, move her in for now. Um... Yeah, she's really bad at fighting and building and stuff. So that's a downside. Chef. Constant. Not good at it, but has passion for it. It's really bad skills. Mmm, a lot of passion for mining. That is not bad at all. Body purist. And my body is limited for a reason. To her, artificial body parts are mythical and disgusting. Got out of my colony. Ooh, look at this character too. Can't do intellectual. Uh, careful shooter, but um, can't really shoot. Uh, okay. Yeah, plant and crafting. Uh, let's move you in here and let's see what our team is like. We don't really have a cook. Don't really have a cook. That is about the only dance. Oh, no, grab. Why? No, 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 no. There we go. I wanted... I wanted he told me, right? I think. I think I wanted he told me. So yeah, we, we're not really good on the intellectual side of things. We, we really suck at cooking. We don't actually have any good mining skill, but that would be offset by the fact that we actually do have this. It's interesting that it doesn't show that we have passion for it here. So I guess it just shows the highest skill. Yeah, it does. And whether or not we have passion there. Do we have passion for cooking? No. So we could really do with better cook. Um, not being able to do art is really not a problem. Not being able to do intellectual stuff is also not really a problem. I'm... <sighs> I'm thinking that maybe we need to reroll Patty here. It's not a bad character at all, but I think uh, she is kind of redundant. Um... Yeah, she, she, she would be a plant person. We have a planting person here. Alright, so let's, let's re-roll uh, Patty here. And what we're going to try is get a cook. Who can do everything, essentially. Let's see what we get. Uh, that's not too bad. She's a nudist. She's kind. Um, decent fighter. Some passion for art. Not bad. Let's reroll someone else instead. Wow, that's a smart person. Jealous, volatile. Eh. But we don't need a smart person. We need a, a, a cooking person. Let's uh, see if we get a cook. There we go. Oh, look at this. This is actually a really good character. Cooking, planting, animal, social and intellectual. Hiroshi, Gourmand. Okay, gets more hungry, but we will have decent amounts of um, uh, of food, I'm thinking. So maybe him instead of Pitomi? Alright, I think that's a party. It's not a really good party, but it's a party. Oh, look at this. And... Uh, Oh no, we're leaving behind his granddaughters. Wait, what? Granddaughter. He's age 40. 
How did that happen? Oh, that's... Wait, wait. Oh, so he's really 110. All right, so he was frozen. Okay, no, then that works. Okay. Um, all right, we're leaving behind his granddaughters. That's... that's We're monsters right off the bat here. Child spy. Oh, I love the, the storytelling this generates. So Hiroshi is a civil servant, right? Um, he's got two granddaughters at the very least that we know of. And that's Koyota, who is, uh, you know, just a Hive World drone here. So Koyota just basically lives on a Hive World in the... Maybe in the administration, like, like the grandfather. But the other granddaughter is a child spy. Like, okay, all right, let's let's go with this crew here. Um, we're probably gonna die anyway, so. <laughs> uh, I like building. My oh, okay, we had that already. Yeah. I can never decide whether a large map is actually an advantage or a disadvantage. Now it means, of course, that when people spawn at the borders, you have more time until they arrive. But it also means, and there are more resources on the map. But it also means that whenever, for example, you want to pick something up, the way to get there are far, far, far larger, uh, it's far further, and uh, that means, you know, more more dangerous animals. That means, you know, um, more exposure to cold. It means getting hungry or hungry on the way. It means further round, uh, fewer round trips in the same amount of time. So. I'm not really sure. It's really an advantage to go with a large map. All right, the three of you awaken from your crypto sleep in your crypto sleep sarcophagi to the sound of sirens and ripping metal. That always evokes to me the beginning of um, Pitch Black, you know, where this uh, spaceship flies into the the. I don't even remember what it is. this is like a like an asteroid belt or like a like a tail of a comet and like these small. Fragments just just rip through the spaceship and uh, just basically kill off half the passengers in their in their sleep. Um, sometime later, you land on this unknown rim world. As pieces of the shredded starship fall around you, you start making plans to survive. All right. Oh, there's a bridge here! Yay! All right. So there we go. There are some materials here in the river for starters, and there's a piece of the spaceship here. So there is some stuff here. Let's have a look at where we want to settle. Um, I'm probably not going to go to the corners here. But at the same time, I feel like we don't want to... Um, is this really a large map? I feel like this might not be... Did they change the map sizes? It's a bit smaller than it used to. Huh. Well, I'm not sure if you want to settle right here. Uh, let's see, what's that? Mud. We don't like mud. There's rich soil here, though. That's something. We could settle here. There's a lot of space here. What's mud up here? That's unfortunate. Stony soil. No rich soil here, but there is a geothermal here. And there are two buildings that we could come under here. And there's rich soil here. So how about we build our base right here? I think this is a lovely place. Like, if I crashed here, right, and then I, I looked around and, and, you know, maybe like the first hour we would take like a walk here, walk here, just to see where we're at. Um, I think, and, and I would want to build a little away from the road, right? I mean, nearby, yes, but this is shielded from view, you know, thanks to this. And uh, we don't really know what sort of people are going to come along this this road here so i think i think this is actually a really good place we have the um geothermal here of course we can't use that right away and the two buildings and i think we're going to primarily settle this one first not even sure if we're gonna settle this but we're not gonna tear that down either all right so let's see we need to um we need to deal with this what sort of animal did we get we got dino the female labrador who can, in theory, haul. Yes. Okay. All right. Cool. Uh, so that's that. And we have a knife, a rifle, and a pistol, as always. So let's have a quick look who can use what. Uh, no, not lock. Bio? Bio. It's now called bio. Um, okay. So you cannot really use it. You could use melee. 
You're a good shot. Uh, oh, this is going to be tough. So she's got a lot of passion. But not as good as skill. And he's got, he got a really good skill and less passion. I'm thinking... I'm thinking he's going to get the, uh, the rifle. And she's going to get the pistol here. And you're going to get the knife. Just because that's about the only thing you can use. Uh, oh, we got a plasteel helmet. That is new that you start with that. And there's flag pants here. What's that? A piece of armor. Okay. Okay, so we started off with some decent gear. Uh, that is unusual. Uh, we are going to... First of all... We're going to claim... This building here. Huh. Alright, those icons have changed. Uh, we do need to haul these things away. Let's create a dumping zone right away. Um, where we're gonna do this? It doesn't really matter, right? So let's create a dumping zone, something like this. And then we need to... We need to plug the holes here. And I think we're gonna use wood for pretty much everything at start. So... Yeah, we don't have any just yet. And yeah, like that. And a door right here. And then we're going to create a stockpile zone. I don't want this to be too close because we are going to expand this uh, fairly quickly, I think. So I'm thinking we're going to do the stockpile zone... Something like this. Yep, that sounds good. Uh, we need... What do we need? Oh, I haven't played this in so long. We need some sleeping spots. So, I don't know. Like that. And... For the dog as well. There we go. Yep, okay. Good start. Now we need to... We need to definitely unforbid all these items. Uh, what was that? F. Yeah. Yeah, and I don't actually care who wears what here. What's that? Components. Yeah, we want those. And... I th think... Yeah... Something like this. I think this is a good start. Um, we probably then want to unforbid all these items that are in the river. What's that? A hair. Okay, we're not going to start with hunting right away. I'm not going to unpause just yet. Uh, we do need to set up some growing things. Uh, let's send all of that away. What's this? Bramble. Okay. That's new, I think. Alright, let's set up some uh, fields. Growing zones. Now, we need something decent that's not too big. Um, and I'm not really sure what the balance is here. Uh, I think we're going to set up at least two fields. Um, let's make them longish. I want to waste as little of the rich soil as possible. Ah, so one here. Wait, did I do two, four? Yeah, I did five, right? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, okay. So we're going to do... Yeah, potato plants here. Gonna do rice here. Rice because it grows very fast. And we're gonna do a third one. Um, which we're going to shape differently, I guess. And yeah, these are fairly large, I guess. We're gonna do um, heal root here. None of your characters. Okay, whatever. We still want heal root here, so you're going to learn. All right, let's see. Next step: work. Uh, yep, that's fine. I feel like there's never any reason to not set this on one. 
And where's the basic? What's basic? Ah, flick switches, release prisoners, open containers. Okay. Every time we want something flipped or switched, that's what we want. Uh, let's see. Cooking. It's going to be your priority. Hunting. What's that? Oh, copy. Oh, we can now copy this. Okay. Schlitzer, I, I don't, I don't, we're not going to start any hunting here. But yes, I feel like these two are going to be our hunters here. Um, construction. Sure. And then, yeah, what's your, you have no passion. You do have a lot of passion. Three and four. Yeah, these guys need um, a lot of practice here. Plant cutting. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, we're not going to do this. He's got no skill. He's got to just botch everything. Quark. Hitaro. Crafting. And that's good research here. So let's also go with that. I'm fine with this for now, I think. Uh, let's also set you for priority cooking. You have passion for it. Your skill sucks, but you need to learn. And you may cook if there's nothing else to do. No, let's just set these to doctor if, if uh, Schlitzer here is not available. Okay, so I think this is what we're going to start out with. Um, let's now unpause this. And they can start gathering things. This is a lot of work already queued. Um, our first priority, of course, in construction is going to be to set up um, power infrastructure and a fridge of some sort. I think we're going to actually build that sort of here. Mm, we could also do worse than actually just build a roof over the... over the... Um, uh, the stockpile here. Yeah. Okay. See? Construction bodge. There we start. But it's fine. We got plenty of wood available. Go fix that. Haul the rock away. Clean out that ruin. We have a place to live. It's not much, but it's a start. It's a roof over our heads, and we didn't even have to work for it, so that's... Oh, it doesn't have a roof yet. Uh, oh, I think they're gonna do that as soon as the door is done, right? And you're you're sick. Uh, it's the crypto sleep sickness. Okay, so that's at least not not a problem. Yep, let's uh, go build that door. You're oh, you're probably needing some more wood. No. You're just deciding to do something else for no reason. Okay, there we go. Now we are having a roof over our head. Well done, Schlitzer. Yeah, no idea where we get that corrugated iron, but we're gonna use it anyway. It's probably part of the ship. Yeah, no, but that's good. All right, start growing things. Chopping down this. What's that? Oh, berry bushes. Very nice. Yeah, we're gonna cut. Oh, you're just gonna sleep. All right, fine. Right, so let's have a look. Power. Okay, we cannot actually build batteries off the start. That's new. Um, where is simple research bench? All right, and that's suddenly becoming a bit of a priority here. Uh, we'll put that. Yeah, you know what? We're gonna put that in there. Definitely need batteries. It's like. No brainer. Some compact machinery here. We're not gonna mine anything we don't need. What's that? Wild heel root. Nice. Okay. I think I'm gonna just let them do things for now. Oh, do we have someone assigned to train animals? Alright, and... Not seeing it. 
Do we even have animal? Wait a second. Do we even have animal skill anymore? Bed rest, doctor, patient, warden. Live a chat with prisoners. Handle. Oh, handle. Ah, okay. Feed, slaughter, milk, shear, tame, and train animals. Okay. It's a bit weird that they renamed that from animal to handle. I mean, I see why, of course, but... I would have thought that calling that animal was just perfectly fine. Are these wave new? Oh, look at that. Yeah, yeah, look at this. I think that's new, right? That's like actually current here. Look at this. That is definitely new. Oh, this is beautiful. I'm loving, liking this a lot. Yeah, look at that. This looks awesome. <laughs> oh, what's this? Is this what I think it is? It is packaged survival meals. Yes, please. Let's pick these up before they get soggy and wet and, you know, get washed down the river. Definitely gonna pick those up. How many is that? And it's only three, but still, that's three meals. I think that's worth picking up. Oh. And we have some here. Nobody picked these up yet. There's still a lot of stuff here. Interesting. Uh, work. Hauling. Let's put that on a bit of a part. You know what? No, two is fine. Two is fine. Two is fine. Pick that I um that metal up as well. What's that? Ancient lamppost. Oh, okay. Alright. So, first night on this uh, new planet. Everybody's asleep. Very happy that they escaped alive, of course. Uh, maybe still haunted by the nightmares of uh, the disintegrating ship and the dying crewmates and family members and you know they're just all hoping that they got out alive can we see oh look at that they're friends actually so at least they're happy that they uh, escaped together yeah look at this they all like each other quite a bit Um, no, except you. You don't like each other much. Anton Manos. Grand okay, so the relationships were saved. Oh, okay, so the, I guess this means they actually did escape. And they are now part of the Kingless Confederation of Iveria. Uh, his father is part of the Terrifying Raccoons. And you basically just have an animal and friends. Well, not friends. Compatriots. Fellow Crashlanders, whatever. Okay. All right. So I guess their, their family did make it out alive, but um, they are maybe a little resentful for not being in the same escape pod or something. Or perhaps they don't even know that they are alive, right? So they just escaped and they're now part of this new community. They were taken in as survivors, very grateful. And they're now basically just um, um, just living with them. And then maybe at some point, if they do come raiding us, uh, they're doing it without actually knowing that their friends and family are here. And it's a very tragic moment when that happens because they might get killed on either side. Okay. Um, okay, you're eating. That's fine. All right, so let's see. We do have... Oh, we didn't set a project yet, did we? How do we do that? Research. There we go. Um, mm, 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 there's a lot of tech options here. Batteries here. We definitely want that first, I think. Yeah. Start with uh, batteries. We definitely want a fridge. Uh, it's not super warm outside, but food is going to go bad. And uh, yeah, let's actually hunt the squirrel there. Minor brick risk. What's your problem? Serious pain. Oh. Psychite addiction. Did not see that when I generated the character. What's a psyche? That's drugs, right? No, well, that sucks. That could be a problem. Because we don't have drugs. Got 
Gotta chop down the trees here. So this is where we're gonna expand anyway. But yeah, let them let them plant first. That's that's definitely a priority. Yeah, you do the hauling. That's good, good, good. It's a lot of stuff still here that we do need to secure before someone comes along and takes it. Oh, look at this. There's a lot of compacted steel here. That's nice. Very nice. And it's not too far away either. Probably want to grab this at some point. And we could, in theory, because this is rich soil, right? So we could, in theory, set up a... Uh, uh, you know, we could set something up here that takes a long time to grow. So they go here once, plant it, and then they return when it's done. I'm not sure what this would be, but, uh, yeah. Oh, my nephew just sent me a message that he was, uh, fishing. And, uh, he caught a fish. Well done, nephew. Very manly. I remember when I was a kid, my father wanted to get me into uh, fishing as an angling. I just, just have like vague memories of that. But that was never for me. <laughs> it's like, you know, I don't know. And I'm not, like, I'm not against it or anything, right? I'm not like, oh, the poor fish. I mean, you know, it's fine. It's just like... I don't know, standing next to a body of water with a stick in your hand and just waiting. <laughs> this doesn't seem like a good time to me. But, you know, it's fine. Alright, so we're finally picking up the, the goods here. That's good. Uh, no pun intended. Yeah, let's hunt the, the, the squirrels. We hunt the squirrel here. Can't see a dead body. Um, let's see. Yeah, so we do want a uh, fridge here. We're gonna make that nice and big. We do have plenty of trees here, so there's no reason not to. Yeah, bridge. I'm really happy they added that. That was missing from this game for the longest time. Uh, let's see. Let's so make this maybe seven by seven. I think that's a. I mean, interior space. I think that's decent. So that would be eight here. And then like this. And we probably wanna... One, two, three. Yeah, we definitely need to have like a... You know, I call them airlocks. Uh, let's just keep this simple for now. This is kind of dumb, isn't it? Right, whatever. It'll, it'll work. Uh, the idea here is that uh, when they open this, uh, not as much warm air will, uh, cold air will escape. So, yeah. And yeah, we could do with an opening here, but I think the main uh, traffic that will happen here is at least at first um, to the to the fields here. I'm not sure. We'll see. Uh, what we could do, of course, is this, and then we could cancel uh, these two here. Sure, why not? It uh, looks a little less dumb. Speed up a bit in the night. There we go. What does that mean? Neat defenses. Yes, we do. We need so many other things, too. Okay, you're wearing uh, armor. That's probably a good thing. Schlitzer is going to be one of our main uh, fighting guys. Uh, yeah, definitely. It's a night owl. Yep. Go and build that stuff. Can we still see... Like, at the at the start of the game, we had the, um, the party view, right? Like, what were our best skills? It'd be actually really nice if we could still see that. I don't think we do. Like, if that were, like, you know, like, 
here somewhere. It would show you like the highest skills everywhere or whatever. I don't know. Just would be interesting to see like your overall progression in terms of character skills. It does need a floor. You might want to place stove close to fridge, says Greg. Yes. Yeah, that's the thing. Uh, I'm thinking we want uh, the butchering thing somewhere, probably here on this corner. And for the stove, I think we're going to build more buildings here. Now we can't actually, can we build on bridges? That would be nice. I don't think that's possible, is it? You can! Oh, look at that! Look at that! Ludeon, Tynan, I love you guys. You did well. You did so well. So we could, in theory, we could, in theory, actually build on water. Like, we could build bridges here, like a big thing, and then we could just... Yeah, we could make that into a room. That is actually really, really awesome. Now, I don't know how well this would work with a room that's partially on water. But yeah, let's build a, like a secondary building right here. We're gonna uh, mine this little spot here first. Neat. Minor progress neat. Recreation variety. Oh, we don't have any of that. Thank you for reminding me, game. Uh, where would that be? Zone power recreation. There we go. It's no longer called joy, I guess. Uh, the horse pin thing. We're going to set that up and we're going to put that not too far away. Uh, you know what? We're going to put that right there. It's not going to be in the way. It's not much, right? But it's something. Interestingly enough, we don't actually need horseshoes for the horseshoe pin. All right, uh, you're picking things up still. And did we pick up the food? We did not. I'm a s oh, look at that. There is a timber wolf here. That is a problem. We got to visit her. Mafalu Shaman, uh, she's named Menino Mirax. Uh, she seems to have items for trade. All right, cool. So when she gets to the colony, uh, we are going to have a look at what she's got and we definitely we definitely want to um, actively hunt any predators in the area uh, Okay, Bre Greg Breck Yeah, it's not my day today. Uh, see you in 30 minutes <laughs> uh, If I'm still alive otherwise well still see you in 30 minutes I guess Unless I am not alive in 30 minutes, which I hope is going to be the case. Yeah, so we definitely want to actively hunt any and all predators we have around here. That timber wolf in the southeast seems to be like the first target. All right, who is our best social person, actually? Let's have a quick look. Uh, wait, no. Uh, there we go. So, social two. Four, uh, no, two, seven, Hiroshi, hi, Hiroshi, um, how about you talk to this person? Oh, you were, oh, you were researching, no, that's fine, okay. Right, so let's see, your negotiator, Hiroshi, cannot talk properly because of poor health. This will affect trade prices. Well, that's lovely, isn't it? Um... Um, so she's got one unit of herbal medicine for 12. I think I'm gonna buy that. Well, 13 in this case. But other than that, I think we're good. I don't think we need the food. Um, um, we could buy the pen. Well, no, you know what? Let's let's just accept it like this for now. I was I was thinking we could actually buy the pemmican and feed that to the dog. That's a that's a thing, right?
No, probably not worth. It. You know what? We're not gonna buy any of this. It's it's fine. We're, we're we're good. We do need food. That's for sure. We don't have that many meals left. And the bloody dog is eating some of them. So yeah. Wait a second. So who was the second fighter? Okay. So these two are the fighters. Uh, where is that timber wolf? Now, timber wolf, dangerous animal. Oh, there's a lot of exploding animals here. Some boars. We don't want to mess with any of these for now. Where did that timber wolf go? Maybe it's far enough away. Right. Uh, let's. Oh, you didn't mind this yet. Okay. Um, let's build the. Butcher table. I'll put that here. Looks like a good spot. Yeah, okay, it has a speed penalty. That's fine. Oh, and I wanted to put a floor in there as well. Let's not forget that. Uh, sandstone. Wood floor. Fridge with a wooden floor. It's gonna be beautiful. There we go. Uh, yeah, let's speed through the night. And you're leaving. The Baba of the Canyon. All right. Um, uh, since it looks like you'll be here for a while, Hotaro thinks that you should give your faction a name. Um, I, I'm always really bad at this. So unless someone has a really good suggestion, I'm going to have to think real hard on this. Um uh, how about we are the lucky survivors? That's uh that's not jinxing it at all, right? Chevis Brook is not a it's not a bad place name actually. Um Yeah, well, we're gonna stay with Chavez Brook. I like that actually. So let's go. Lucky survivors. They're just jinxing it if I've ever seen a jinx. Alright, so the wolf was at this sort of location. There it is. Okay, timber wolf. Yeah, we definitely wanna definitely wanna go there and kill that, I think. Um, let's see. Who is doing what? You are consuming all right so how about you prioritize oh it's already reserved so are you wait no researching yeah haul and haul that this does bring him a little close to the wolf um let's see we cannot see if that thing is hungry or not but I would expect it to go for something other than humans first. So, yeah, let's keep an eye on this. Yep, no, we are gonna sneak in, take these, go back on land and run for it. Well done, well done, Hiroshi. Good job, good job. Very nice. Okay, we are hunting uh, those things. And let's, oh, let's actually also slow this down a bit again. And we're going to just butcher... Oh, kibble, that's what we want to feed the dog. Uh, we're going to do this forever. Uh, there's pretty much never a reason not to slaughter animals. I had to butcher them. Right. I wonder if I can just... Oh, there we go. Mad hair. There we go. Prioritize hunting that thing. Okay, and you can't hit anything. Let's uh, draft you. Attack here, and you're playing horseshoes. Alright, fine. 
No, no, no. All right, just do. Uh, let's do melee attack here, actually. Oh, melee attack. The hair, because um, for some reason the hair can just jump us and interrupt their shoot. All right, that's good. And then, uh, too close. Okay. There we go. Oh, for crying out loud! All right, just just smash that thing. It's just a hair, right? I mean, there we go. Well done. Uh, let's. Wait, no, that didn't work. There we go. No, okay, good, good, good. And you you are allowed. So yeah, bring that back, that's actually good. Alright, cool. So that wasn't glorious, but hey, at least it didn't do any permanent harm. So yeah, I was uh, going to say, maybe we can actually... Oh, that looks disgusting. Maybe we can actually move... Um, Maybe we can actually create a roof over here without building a whole building. All right, stockpiling zone. Let's do that and that. And this has going. This is going to have. Let's see, food stuff. Yep, definitely food stuff. <clears throat> and um, medicines and drugs, I think. <coughs> Excuse me. Not sure about this. Uh, we don't have any of that anyway. Uh, we'll set this to preferred, so it overrides this one here. Yeah, and then we want to see zone build roof area. I'm not sure if this is gonna... Cannot build it over an oak tree. Alright, fine. Zone... No, orders. Chop down all them trees. And you too. And I think he's hunting the, yep, the other squirrel. Well, it gives our people a bit of uh, experience. So it's not terrible. And if the dog eats the meat first before it eats these meals, then that's going to be lovely as well. All right, let's speed through the night again. There we go. Chop them trees. How are we doing on planting skills? Four. Uh, zero. And still four. Yeah. It's gonna be a while before we before we can plant that here root, I guess. It's not something I, I uh, remembered when I created the character, but spell is fine. You know, we'll, we'll get over it somehow. There is some uh, wild heal root, so. We do need the roof so that um, this stuff here doesn't rot and I believe it just needs a roof unroofed outdoors okay so now we need to do actually both well we'll, we'll see um, I don't mind building a wall around this if I have to it's gonna be so super ugly but it'll be fine yeah, do that uh, can we maybe all the meals inside as well and uh, all that as well oh and then okay well that's fine all right so we're gonna sort through this can we now do the the roof we could in theory Need me a source. Yes, I know. I'm, I'm, we're gonna work on it. I'm a bit of we are worried that we're not mining this. Mining. Does that include mining? 
No, mining is here. No, your skill is terrible. Schlitz, if Schlitzer dies, we're really screwed. No. Hey, bunny rabbit. I wanna hunt you. Good job! I was trying to steal our silver, right? <laughs> well shot! Very nice. Hair meat. Square meat. More hair meat. Alright. Alright, so Schlitzer. You're eating. And now you're mining. Good job. Good job. And then we're gonna set up like a... Oh. Uh, this needs to go away. Uh, then we're going to build like a small area here for... Ah, okay, so the battery has been researched, that's good. What do we need next? Solar panel. Ooh, there are water mills. That's good. All right, let's go with uh, with solar panels next. I think that's like something we cannot go wrong with. Okay, so let's see, architect power. Okay, we can build windmills. That's good. Uh, let's build one here, I guess. I think. Um, or something like this. Uh, let's go with that first. And we'll want a battery inside so it doesn't blow up all the time. Yeah, let's put that right here for maximum damage. Waterproof conduit. Oh, interesting. Interesting. Under shallow water. Okay, interesting. Okay, so we don't need that here. I was at first I was thinking that's like proof against rain or something. All right, there we go. And we need to set up a stove, electric stove right here. So we're going to put that Here and we're gonna build a wall around it essentially is the idea here This is uh, not gonna be pretty Yeah, so it's gonna be super not pretty but you know Pretty has nothing to do with it Yeah, we do need to... You botched the construction, Schlitzer! Oh. What is your skill? Uh, four. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. I wonder if I should disable construction on... Uh... Yeah... No, okay. They both need to learn, so... It's a bit annoying. Okay, so I guess we can't build the roof here because we don't actually have um, walls, which makes sense. So I'm thinking we do need to build a wall around this. Let's um, do that real quick. There we go. Don't need any quote-unquote airlocks here. I'm not actually sure if we can build a roof over this. We may have to build some support pillars in the center, but we'll find out. That's how it used to be, but who knows. All right, let's speed through the night again. 
So far, no deaths, so... Cheers to that. <sighs> Hello, little bunny rabbit. You're gonna get hunted. Yep, dog is eating our rations. Well, screw you, dog. If you weren't... Who's? Uh... Someone's bonded animal, I would totally just use you for food. Yeah, you can botch the walls all you want, don't care. We've got plenty of wood. That's all. That's awesome. Yeah. Don't budge that, please. We only have one component? Oh, no, for 25. Okay, no, that's fine. Right. Yeah, I definitely want a water mill. Um, because we do have the river. Might as well use it, use it for good, right? Plus, it is something I've never used. Okay, so... Major break risk. What is your problem? That's the addiction, right? Yep. It is. Withdrawal. I'm not sure what that is. Um, I guess it's like drugs. Serious pain. Night, all in daytime. Oh, right, right, right. Schlitzer is in. Oh, I remember. Uh, let's see. Okay, Schlitzer. Um, no, you are going to work during this time, and you're going to sleep, I don't know, sleep there, and do anything. Uh, let's, let's start there with the sleep. You can work a little in the daytime, something like this, right? Let's get you, let's get you... Indoors during uh, during the day. It's fine. Just don't make a lot of noise when everybody else is sleeping, okay? Yeah, that was important. Stacking up those meals. Well done, well done. Alright, while they are working, let's scroll around a bit. See what else there might be on the map. They might find some more... Meals. It used to be that they, those were real, real common. Nowadays, of course, not so much. Um, you know what? Let's grab that metal. There's no predator inside. There's a turtle here. We could hunt. Of course, why not? Awesome! Our first raid! 